What is up you guys? My name is Thaddeus, I got the G-Wag here today and I'm gonna be showing you guys how to automate your drop shipping. I left my laptop in the car so I'm trying to fucking unlock it with it. There we go. I suck at opening these doors. All right, let's get started. Let's get started. I am in the G-Wag right now. Shit, where'd I put my keys? Fuck, put them right here. All right, I want you guys to hear, I want you guys to hear the startup, all right? Listen to this, ready, 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 ready. Oh, my laptop bag's right there. All right, so. What are we talking about today? I need to turn the AC down. You guys won't be able to hear me, but it's fucking hot. Um, so what are we talking? Um, basically, how to automate your dropshipping site, right? You're you're getting orders, you're getting results. Like things things are like looking good for your site, and you want to free up your time, right? Because obviously, like the key to like making money and being financially free is removing time from the equation. Okay, so that's what we're about to do. And how you do that is with virtual assistants. Okay, you're gonna like basically. I'm gonna walk you guys through then how to like give it like how to just basically set them up like good good to go, good to go. And then all you gotta do is literally just. Like walk them to like just tell them what to do, right? Show them how to fulfill orders. Um, show them how to like respond to customer emails if you if you have a like a customer support funnel that you're sending people through, um, then you can do that as well. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna do a screen share. When do you see a screen share from someone in a in a in a car um, happening, right? I right, fuck the gurus, bro. I'm gonna show you guys how to get this shit done. Let's go right now, man. I'm fucking high, bro. I had I downed a Red Bull like like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> We're doing good, guys. There is um um shit. You know, I had notes on my Evernote. I'm gonna pull those up real quick, just so I don't forget anything that I'm supposed to be saying. Um, cause I've done that before in other videos where like I'm like, oh fuck, I forgot to say something, and then um. Yeah, that sucks. Alright, see, like, always got my notes. Always got my notes. Yeah. Okay, wow, that's a lot of notes. Or if you, if you are interested in my lifestyle channel, I just got back from a cruise from Mexico with the squad. Um, cue the montage. Let's go. Woo. So you just watch the montage or like a portion of it. If you want to see the whole thing, link is in the description for my other YouTube channel. It's pretty dope. I didn't actually have, um, I had no control over the camera or what was being filmed. I literally just asked the video guy like, yo, send me the footy. I'll scrape something together for my own channel and I made something work. All right. So let's get into the whole virtual assistant dropshipping shit. And um, yeah, let's do it. All right. Let's zoom into the screen right there. Let's boom. Okay. 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 Before we zoom in to the screen right there. Okay. On the laptop. I just want to point out like. Like, look at this setup, bro. Who does a screen share in a G-Wagon? Me. I do that. I do screen shares in a G-Wagon, okay? For information, because, you know, the people want the information, the people are gonna get the information. Okay, back to the Zoom, let's go. Whee! Okay, so I was about to start the whole, like, screen share, the laptop's right down here, and I just realized that I don't have Wi-Fi. But fuck it, guys. I'm gonna turn on my personal hotspot. Let's get that information over to you guys, yeah? Okay, sounds good, let's go. All right, so we're down in the fucking laptop, right? And so what you do when you wanna find virtual assistants, I personally use Upwork. There's there's a bunch of different sites that you can go to to find um, to find these virtual assistants, right? And it's like, if you have a preference, it doesn't matter. But what matters is like what you're looking for in these, right? So when you go to Upwork, okay? We're here at Upwork, you can click Browse. Okay, and then we're gonna go down to Virtual Assistants. Click that. Yeah. And I'm sorry if it's slow, I'm on a personal hotspot in a parking garage, sitting in the g -Wet. Okay, so. We're here, it loaded, all right? I thought it would take longer, so I was gonna like go off on a tangent. But we're chilling, okay? And go down here, some of most independent pros. Okay, we need virtual assistants. We need people that'll just do like data entry on website, you know, on AliExpress, on Oberlo, um, handle customer support management, and that, that stuff, right? So okay, now we're here, and you got Um, You wanna change the hourly rate to 10 hours, like $10 an hour and below, okay? You can find really good ones for $3 an hour, four, five, six. You can find solid ones for very, very cheap, okay? And depending on your order volume, um, you really, really don't need them that much, right? So, um, me personally, I had them going, when I first started, I had them, um, it was two hours every other day, all right? So, two hours every other day, then they'd fulfill all the orders and customer management, like, all that stuff, okay? Because, um, you know, my customer support email, I said, you know, we get back to you within 48 hours. So, every other day worked, okay? Um, some of you might only need them for one hour every day or one hour every other day, right? It just depends on your order volume and depends how fast, like, like the rate of fulfillment is, for your virtual assistant okay so now we're down here on the screen and you can scroll through 
a bunch of these people, right? What you want to do, right, is you're going to scroll through these. You want them to have a good amount, and I'd say, uh, at least on Upper, you know, it, 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 it displays how much they've earned in the past. I usually go with over 20K earned, or if they show hours, um, I prefer like 2,000 plus hours have like already been worked by them. So you know that they're solid, you know that like they have people going to them for work like already, like prior. Um, the AC's on. I'm going to turn that shit off. But uh, okay, so you know that they like they people have gone to them for work prior, right? And that's what you want to do. So you find them, you want to hit them up. Um, you can use Upwork's like chat box, but you really want to like you want to become tight with these guys, okay? When you first hire them, you're gonna be hand holding them through the entire process for the first week, okay? You don't like you don't let their hands go. And um, ooh, my boy Jay Rich just pulled in with his Tesla. Um, so you're gonna go through, find these virtual assistants, um, message them on Upwork, get their Skype, get their WhatsApp, do something like that, even their email or some shit like that, okay? Those are my boys, those are my boys. I'm fucking recording a video and they're down there. Shit, I gotta like plug them in the figure. I gotta go say hi, bro. We gotta go say fucking hi to these boys. All right, let's go. Yo! What's up, Mr. Nah. We're good. I'm trying to film a fucking video right now. It's a tour. I was like, oh shit, I saw the Tesla pulled up. How you doing, bro? Yeah. What's up? What's up, bro? a month. I think Adobe does like a student discount. And I just do 19 a month. Like, I'm not even a student anymore, but you can finesse. Yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> Video. Oh shit! I just realized it's fucking G wagon. Yo, give it a little gas, like you can fucking hear that thing. For just do it. Oh, man, I'm gonna do, do it, it, bro. Do it. Do it. No, <laughs> you do it. Just Dude, in case something park, bro. Happens, we blame Jared, bro. <laughs> that was good. It's not gonna be me. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's just wild, bro. Where are you about to go? I'm not going anywhere. I left my laptop in here. It's like, fuck it, I'll film a video in there. So I'm just filming a video on how to find virtual assistants in the fucking G Wag, bro. Yo, I did arms yesterday, man. Woo! All right, sorry, that was, that was fucking weird. Oh shit, my screen, is it still recording? There's like these weird lines on my screen now because I stopped the recording, I turned it back on. I don't know what the fuck is going on. We're chilling. Okay, so, um, first of all, if you do have a customer support email or like some sort of customer support ticket that, that you allow customers to reach you at, I'd hire a different virtual assistant for that, okay? So you want one assistant to fulfill all your orders and you want one more to actually like do the cut. Like that's just me preference. Like I just gotta have them separate. Um, if you find one really good one who's willing to do both, then like by all means you can do that. But um, I just like to have, um, you know, two different people working on it um, at the same time, okay? So that's what you wanna do. You're gonna go find them. Upwork is very, very easy to use, guys. I feel like I don't need to go like too crazy in depth. You find one, you hit them up and then you kinda just give them the rundown. You're like, yo, I'm a Shopify dropshipping store owner. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm currently experiencing you know a volume increase than what I usually work with so I'm looking to hire a virtual assistant uh, you know please reach out back to me um, I'd love to work like I'd love to build like a long-term relationship with you um, and work like and just like work with you right um, they'll hit you back up you get their Skype whatsapp email do all that stuff hit them up in the first week right while you're walking them through also if you guys want me to like um, like recreate my actual guides and like PDFs and stuff that I handed to my virtual assistants for them like so that they like, if they ever encounter like problems or troubleshoot they can have something to refer to if you guys want that like you know like comment subscribe <laughs> I always plug but comment something below just like that lets me know that you guys actually want that um, just cuz like that that'll take a lot of work to kind of just recreate and make universal for just every single fucking store uh, just like something easy to do but if you guys want that, comment below, uh, like, do all that fun shit, and I'll like, I'll, I'll link it in this video when I do make it, and I'll like make another video about it. But that's that. Um, now, how do we get them into Shopify? Yeah, you want to give them admin access, okay? So you're gonna go into your Shopify store, and you're gonna just go to settings, um, account, and then you can literally just add staff member or add, you know, like add people to your store and give them permissions, right? Um, you want to make sure that you give them your AliExpress account information as well. Change your password. Um, so it's not something that you use with other um, stores and stuff, just you know, for security guys. You don't want to be stupid and just lose all your shit to a virtual assistant off in the Philippines or wherever you're hiring them from, right? So um, be careful with that. Change your password, and then in Shopify, you want to give them access to you know apps, um, customers, products, that stuff, so that they can you know go in and do what they need to do. Okay, they won't be able to use Oberlo if you don't give them access to the apps or permissions to that shit, right? So that's what you want, and essentially that's that, that's the gist of it, guys. Um, the first week after hiring them, right? You want to be on the phone with them, on Skype, screen sharing for the entire first week, like hand holding them through how to fulfill orders, right? The, the last thing you want is having them fulfill orders like wrong, and you like you lose your money. You still have to order the product to the customer, get that over to them, and like you, you're literally losing money, right? You don't want them to. You don't want them to fuck up. You don't want them to um like like me personally, right? I, when I first started on one of my, on one of my oh my god, I was so stupid. Um, 
I, I thought I had it done. I taught, I like, I handheld them through for the first two days, right? Guys, I'm telling you a week. You gotta do it for a week, okay? The first two days, I thought he was good, right? I was like, all right, this guy's set, he's good to go, I'm gonna lay off, okay? Um, the fourth day, the fifth, fourth, fifth day, I don't know, the fourth day, uh, one of those, like, a few days after, right? He comes and he accidentally bulk orders, um, all the all all of that days laid all of that days like orders to one guy like I mean that guy literally just got like a fat Christmas present but everyone else I had to reorder and you know apologize and just be like shit like we fucked up right so that's the that's the last thing you want okay because like getting someone to purchase from your website is hard enough as it is you don't want them to have issues after like everything should be done for them right they shouldn't have to do anything else on on a customer's end after giving you their money okay you want to be as seamless as possible you don't want any issues and that's why hand holding a virtual assistant at least for the first week you might even need to do more okay depending on your assistant depending how comfortable you are with them um at least a week okay skype screen share all that fun stuff walk them through like all right you need to do this 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 make sure you like you want to run into problems with them while you're on the phone with them so they know how to fucking fix it themselves okay the last thing you want is them like running into problems and just ignoring it be like oh, okay i never like i never was taught how to do this i'm gonna just like skip this right you don't want that okay so i hope you guys enjoy the video it's kind of short but it's definitely something you need if you're trying to like scale your shopify site all right um and again i hope you guys um i hope you guys enjoy the car like this shit's wild right um god damn okay and if you are looking for 25% off the course, I am actually going to be closing the course soon. Um, just because I got like, like, I just got other shit planned and um, there's not really a spot that like, there's, there's not, there's not a place for my course to be. All right. So I'm going to be closing that up. Um, I will make a video about the course though um, in these next few days with, with like some testimonials and screenshots and stuff of like the success students and all that. Um, if you guys are interested, if you want 25% off the course, use code GWAG. Yeah. The fucking baby all right so use that code you'll get 25 percent off it'll probably last i don't even know um all i know is if, if you if you um actually shit no fuck it i'm gonna make it limited right because like you guys are awesome and you know, marketing bro you want to provide scarcity right i teach that in my shopping um, drop shipping course you know you want to make it look like there's you want you want there to be like a not not available all the time right you that's why people run sales that's why people show the amount of inventory left on their website you guys like oh my god i'm dropping content but if you are interested in the course 20 percent 25 percent off i'm only gonna give it to the first 15 people if you click the link and the coupon doesn't work um well it means 15 people have already used it okay so that's that hope you guys enjoyed the video like comment subscribe i reply to all you guys' comments i hope you guys enjoy um, this little screen share stuff. I don't usually do too much screen share on YouTube. It's uh, like I do a shit ton of that in my course, but that's the deal. Hope you guys like the car, guys. I'm fucking sweating in here because I turned off the AC because I didn't want like the the background noise to be like too too messy or like fucked up or anything like that. Um, but there is a mansion party in LA that me and the squad are going to with a bunch of other entrepreneurs and influencers and uh, my boy outside that like you just saw the little like interlude or whatever. Um, one of them already has the Tesla, the other one's getting their Tesla.